How much are the video games? How are you this morning? Oh, I'm good. Oh, Let me get out of your way. That's cool. Yes, it is. Uh, he, uh, what do you have on that? Let me see. 40 bucks. 40 bucks. 40 bucks. And you can double your money on eBay right now. Or more. I'm putting that This is the. I have things in. How much are the video games? Oh, you can have all three. Just that. 75 bucks? 75. Okay. Do you have any games for him? God, I do, but honey, I could not. And I can't tell you that any of that works. I can tell you these work, I, but not the controllers. I think he said this one may not work. No, he said this one definitely works. And we know this one works. That one. Oh, is that one? I didn't yeah, see that Yeah, it was one. the controllers he said didn't work. So, okay. my son said they all work. Okay. Made me a deal. How about 40 bucks? Would you do 40 bucks? 40 bucks for all three? Yeah. How about 50? Yeah, I'll do the 50. I like selling this bulk stuff. <laughs> yeah. Heck yeah. That's the way to do it. I ain't gonna mess with this stuff. Look how this garage is all done and over with. There you go. Thank you, ma'am. Put them up because my kids were afraid somebody was going to steal them. I had my back turned. Yeah. <laughs> um, Power my miniature and tool. At the moment, it's going to be kind of hard to get to. Oh, okay. Um, How much is your boat? Well, now, I think it's kind of pricey, but they put a $300 price tag on Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. Thank you for backing that up, by the way. Oh, you're very welcome. Appreciate that. I have no idea. It must be, like, a really cool thing. I don't know. I think it's kind of pricey. Oh, my Lord. Oh, yeah. the original. <laughs> How much are the records? $10, all of them. 10 bucks, huh? 10 bucks. And I can guarantee most of them are gospel. <laughs> yeah, if you, like, if, uh, yeah, kind of like keep them all the same price. Yeah, like shoes, 50 cents, or whatever. I'll give you 10 bucks for them. Woohoo! You have any other records, or, like, cassettes, or other... Music stuff? Nope. Okay. Nope. Morning. How you doing today? Do you reupholster the furniture yourself? Yeah, I done that one, yeah. That looks great. 1925. Is it really? Wow. That sure that's some awesome uh, detail. Washington Capitol Hill. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. 30 bucks you could have. I got one here. Too. This is real old. Here. That's a good price. Washington, D.C. you came from? Mm -hmm. You said it came from Washington, D.C.? Capitol Hill, yeah. The lady, uh, she used to work there. Yeah. And she, uh, every time I want to get rid of something, you just take and put it in the van, you know? Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I got it. I, I done that. And, yeah, that looks great. Anything in the garage for sale? Yeah, you're welcome to look in there. Okay, thank you. I've got poker tables and chairs. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of spotty right now. Yeah. I thought we were going to be all right today, and then it just kind of popped out of nowhere. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Did you take five for your sign? Yeah. Okay, cool. Morning. Good morning. How are you doing today? Good, how are you? Doing well. Is the uh, mail sign for sale? Uh, 
What about U.S. mail? No. no. Or the Goodyear? No. Basically anything kind of on this wall? Yeah. 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 Cool. I'm going to make a pile of stuff right here if that's okay. Are you able to work with me on price any if I'm buying a lot of stuff? Okay, so I'm up to five, six, seven, ten, eleven, twelve. Uh, three is fifteen. Three is eighteen. Okay. Eighteen bucks. Sold. Yeah, I appreciate you working with me. There you go. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Drip o later. That's interesting. I'm not sure if I want to get it or not. Put the lid on there because people pick yeah. stuff up before. I bet you I've had that for 20 plus years. Have you really? And it was all, I mean, I don't know anything about it, but. I'll buy it. So I think it's cool. Looking for something for a garage, like a work. This is an island sure don't. countertop. That'd be perfect for a garage. Yeah, it would. Or a craft room in a basement. No doubt. Four big ones. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I'll buy your uh, McDonald's toy. Okay. You have any other old toys like that? I do not. No. Are you 75 cents? We'll just round it up to a buck. Make it easy. Oh. All right. well, thank you. Right. I'm done garage selling for the day. I found a lot of great stuff. Had a lot of fun. I'm heading back to the house now. I'm going to pull everything out that I found and I'll show you guys. All right, guys. I meant to shoot some footage of what I found on Thursday. But it's been a couple days. We're going on vacation tomorrow. So we've been getting ready for everything. So finally getting around to pulling this out and showing you guys what I found. I got a PS2 with the box. I think it's got like one controller, all the hookups, no games. It's the it's the fat version, they call it. There's a slim version and a fat version. This one's not worth as much. But with the box. I'm thinking it might be worth 40 or 50 bucks. I paid 10 for it. Got some cool signs at one sale. I got this garage sale sign. It's metal and it's definitely vintage. It says garage sale of trash and treasures. I paid three bucks. I just think it's cool. I'm gonna try to find a place to hang this somewhere in the basement. Got this little electric fence sign. It's probably a reproduction. I got this Disney World Magic Kingdom. It's like a map. From 1979. I paid a buck for it. Might not be worth anything, but it's pretty neat. And I got this clipboard for a dollar. It is Transmissions Unlimited. Uh, it was a company in Indiana. Just thought it had some cool graphics. Somebody might want it. Got an old Coke tray. Almost all of the old Coke trays I see are reproductions. Most of the reproductions will say something on the back that it's actually a reproduction, but some of them you have to find it like on the lip It'll say, you know, this is a it'll literally spell it out. This is a reproduction Tray made in 1975 or whatever and the old ones are, you know, from like the 20s and 30s This is a genuine Antique slash vintage, you know tray. It's not a reproduction. I think it was like 40s or 50s I sold one similar to it before it's in really poor condition. I only paid five bucks, but 
in the shape that it's in, I'm guessing maybe it's worth 40 or 50 bucks, but still pretty cool. Got a lot of the coloring to it still. There's another sign I found. I just found a bunch of signs on Thursday. This is a lucky strike sign with the airplane. Here's asking 10, but I got it for five. It's definitely a reproduction, but still has some cool graphics. These three consoles here, I got these and a few controllers. She was asking 75 and she even asked that knowing that one of these didn't work. She said it was probably this one. Um, but I got them all for 50. It's kind of a lot to pay, but this one right here is the Star Wars edition, Xbox 360. And if it works with the cables and everything, it's probably around, you know, 80 to to $100, I think is what it's worth. Then the PlayStation 3, if it works, maybe 50 bucks, I think, 40 bucks, somewhere around there. This one I'll probably just have to sell for parts or maybe... I don't know, pull something out of it and just sell it as is. Got this McDonald's toy. This is from this is from the 80s, I believe. 1982. It's kind of like a drive-through station. It's pretty neat. Had some of the accessories. I paid 75 cents. I think I just rounded up to a dollar. Like here, just take the buck. And I think it's worth about I don't know 35, 40 dollars. If you guys see the McDonald's Play Place or like the playset things, always keep an eye out because some of them are worth a lot of money. Got this old game. It's metal and it's sort of like a, almost like a ski ball kind of. Like it's got six balls and you just roll them in and get different scores. It was $3. Couldn't find a maker anywhere on it, but still thought it was cool. Got this old teapot. I think it's a teapot. On the bottom it says drip o later. And it's got some pretty neat graphics on it. I don't do a lot with this kind of stuff, but it looked neat. And it was only $4, so took a chance. That's it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.